dear learner welcome in my lecture of web technology today i will discuss about creating a table using jsp example creating a table database i am dr ashutosh bhat associate professor school of computer science and it uttarakhand open university so first of all the learning objective of this lecture the main learning objective of this lecture are to manipulate table data using jsp and implementation of database connectivity in jsp in previous lecture we have discussed about java server pages with jdbc basic steps to connect database install mysql step to run jsp using tomcat server so so many um, things we have learned in the previous lecture now first of all we have to understand how what is table and uh, you can see in this presentation in slide in this slide that the table where the first row is the table heading th you can see here uh, the three th these three are the table heading table head it is called and then we have table data table body t body so uh, table is divided into two parts the first one is the table heading and second is the table body so first line table heading and then the rest line rest all lines are table body again you can see the first line first line first of all we will write the caption then th uh, table head uh, it is also called th and this is the first line and then the table body and at last table footer table foot so uh, we have to focus on uh, in these two table heading and table body now see this program where we have defined table heading and table body the program is started by html and then table and the program the title of the program program that calculate power of 2 so you can see the output of this so this is power of 2 1 0 uh, to the power 2 1 to the power 2 2 to the power 2 Three to the power two means we are uh, we are processing the square of uh, natural number zero to nine. So this way you can see power of uh, two to the power exponent means two to the power zero, two to the power one, two to the power two, two to the power three, two to the power four. Accordingly, we are finding the output. See uh, the program where the first table row first row tr it will started by the tr then inside tr we have table heading and uh, these two headings are here exponent and 2 to the power expo exponent so you can see clearly these two heading in this output exponent and 2 to the power exponent so the first first row will so first row will display the exponent and the second row will display 2 uh, to the um, uh, power exponent now uh, you can see in the next line after heading that is jsp statement and we have written here percentage at the rate page import java dot language dot star so by this by this we are importing the uh, language package all the function and classes of language package then we are defining the variable integer percentage exclamation integer i and we are closing it then we have written here the for loop percentage for i equals to 0 i less than 10 and i plus plus after semicolon so the loop will run from 0 to 9 means less than 10 means 0 to 9 so you can see in the output uh, we have 0 to 9 fig, uh, values and uh, as a exponent in the first first column then uh, the curly bracket will start and now you can see here the tr tr is a statement of html so uh, it will not encapsulated between percentage percentage less than sign and percentage greater than sign so tr is a html statement so it is html statement it is not jsp statement so written outside the percentage less than sign now td now the data 
सो डेटा इज परसेंटेज इक्वल साइन आई सो परसेंटेज इक्वल इज यूज टू डिस्प्ले द वैल्यू इन जी एस पी फॉर द आउटपुट सो वी हैव इनकेप्सुलेटेड लेस देन परसेंटेज साइन एंड इक्वल साइन देन आई देन परसेंटेज देन ग्रेटर देन साइन सो दिस वी आर डिस्प्लेइंग द वैल्यू ऑफ आई इन द फर्स्ट फील्ड फर्स्ट कॉलम ऑफ द फर्स्ट कॉलम ऑफ द सेकेंड रो because first row is the heading and second row is the second row is the table data so the first table data so initially i is zero so it is displaying zero here zero you can see in the first column in second row now uh, td will be closed now the second data second td means second data table data that is math we have written here uh, this function predefined function math function math dot power function it is under a uh, uh, language package uh, that's why we have imported java dot lang dot star so this uh, mat dot power function is inside language package lang package so percentage equal sign mat dot power 2 to the power i the in first column we are displaying i and in second column we are displaying 2 to the power i so initially i is 0 so 2 to the power 0 is 1 always the power of any value if zero then it will be 1 to the power 0 it will be 1 so see uh, this uh, power dot uh, mat dot power 2 to the power 0 it will display 1 uh, uh, then td will close and tr will close and then you can see again this curly bracket which we have to close this is the part of jsp so uh, again we have encapsulated between the jsp tags so uh, the loop will again run uh, and next time i will be one uh, in first time it will be zero and ne next time it will be one so uh, in next time when it will run then td will display the value of i as one and uh, again the second td will display mat dot power 2 to the power 1 means 2 so it will display value 2 so accordingly Uh, accordingly curly bracket will in uh, occur and then third time will loop run uh, in third time the value of i will be 2 so again we will come inside the loop then i will be displayed in first td mean first data uh, block it no first column it will be 2 and uh, the mat dot power function again will run and it will display 2 to the power 2 means 4 4 will be displayed displayed here so accordingly it will uh, run uh, 10 time up to 9 and accordingly the output will be displayed over uh, over your screen so this is the program of table where we are displaying power of uh, uh, calculating power of power of 2 uh, so uh, this is output and this is program so you can understand it very easily and we can run it very easily so this is very simple program now see the another program in this program uh, we are also using the loop uh, but we are using here array also so this is also a, a different kind of program so the title of the program jsp code that has table containing item uh, price quantity and total price so these are three field and uh, now we are starting the program html and body then heading one and order form so uh, the output you can see an order form and uh, now see again we have uh, this jsp statement we have defined three array uh, by percentage exclamation string item this is uh, size is undefined because we can we can expand it so initially we have stored here three value we can uh, store many values more than three value also here so we have not defined the size of array double price price is a double type item is a string type because we are writing the name of item in price array we are writing the price of these item and quantity it will be always it will be integer because uh, we will buy the value by the uh, by uh, we will purchase or sell any item it will be in uh, it will not be in fraction so that's why we have written here integer so uh, the toaster its price is 9.9 and its quantity is 2 so this way we are uh, doing it and uh, second is cd its price is 12.99 and its quantity is 9 so accordingly we are uh, given the values here also 
so this uh, gsp statements are closed and then table will start and first row of table you can see clearly mentioned here the first row where we have four four uh, headings while we have three variable uh, initially uh, stored uh, with the values so here three here four values are four headings are there item price quantity and total price you can see the output item price quantity and total price these are four headings here and now uh, now we will execute the uh, uh, rest of the code where we will display all these three value so we require the loop of three the for loop of uh, which will run three time so first of all we have to start the for loop then uh, we will start the td block so you can see here this for loop for i equals to 0 less than 3 so three time it will run and uh, curly bracket will start the uh, uh, inside it so it will be closed because it, that jsp statements are closed also then tr is the html statement so we will write here tr and slash tr and then td so we have three values and fourth value is price into quantity this this uh, total price will be calculated by price into quantity 19 0.99 into 2 equals to 39.98 so accordingly price into quantity all the values of total price will be uh, generated here so this is this this uh, program you you can see here uh, we have given here td uh, percentage equals to item percentage equals to price percentage equals to uh, quantity all three value i percentage equals to i value i value of item i value of price i value of quantity and initially i zero means zero value of item zero value of price zero value of quantity and multiplication of zero value of price and quantity we are displaying in fourth fourth column so uh, this this uh, uh, is the output and accordingly tr will be closed and for for loop will be closed then to table will be closed body and html we have uh, closed it so this this is the output of this program so uh, thank you learner thank you very much after learning this uh, lecture uh, the learner uh, the learning outcome of this lecture learner will be able to manipulate table data using the jsp and learner can store multiple rows in html table using looping statement of jsp and in next lecture we will discuss about jsp database connectivity select operation insert operation so thank you learner thank you once again